Assalamu alaikum, good evening guys, and welcome back to our specimen paper series here on C Results Academy. Um, today we are beginning with number 11, right? So these are the first uh, measurement type questions that we'll be doing in this specimen paper. Of course, we're in section one, so it won't be too difficult, but still um, our aim is to get as many marks as possible in the exam total if we can, right? So Betty's weight is 46,000 grams. What is her weight in kilograms? Okay, so all we have to remember here is that there are 1,000 grams in a kilogram, right? 1,000 grams in a kilogram. So one kg is equal to 1,000 grams. And knowing this, we have to now simply divide the 46,000 by 1,000, and that will give us our answer, right? So we have 46,000 divided by 1,000, and that is going to leave me with 46 kilograms, okay? 46 kilograms. So my answer will be 46 kilograms. Okay, guys, so we are on number 12 now. Ethan started an online mathematics class at the time shown on the clock. Class lasted 45 minutes. What time did the mathematics class end? All right, so basically what we need to do here is to read off the time of the class, right? The time of the, the beginning of the class. So the time here <clears throat> is 10 minutes after 10, right? 10 minutes after 10. Now the class lasts 45 minutes. So basically what we'll have to do here is just add 45 minutes to this time and we'll get the end time of the class. And that is going to give us a time of 10.55. Okay, 10.55 is the time where, that's, where this particular online class will have ended. Or they didn't tell us whether it's um, EM or PM. So we're just going to leave it as 10.55. So don't go anywhere, guys. We have just a short message for you, and we'll be back with number 13. Hope you're enjoying the video, guys. Just wanted to remind you of my six-week SEA math crash course that takes place or begins on the 26th of April. And the deadline for registration is the 23rd of April, Friday the 23rd. So please give me a call before then or a text or a WhatsApp message at 392-5296. And also, don't forget to subscribe to us on our YouTube channel at C Results Academy and to follow us on Instagram and Facebook, okay? Now let's get back to the video. Okay, so here we are with number 13. Convert two and one fifth hours to minutes. Two and one fifth hours to minutes. Okay, so first of all, we have to know how many minutes there are in one hour, right? There are 60 minutes in one hour. So we can convert the two hours quite easily into minutes. Two multiplied by 60 is going to give me 120 minutes. Now, what about one fifth? Of an hour, one fifth of an hour. To get that, we'll basically have to di divide um, 60 by 5. All right, 60 by 5, which is going to give me 12. All right, so all together now, if I sum these 120 minutes to 12 minutes, right, I'm going to get a total of. 132 minutes, 132 minutes. So I have a final answer here of 132 minutes. Now, if I wanted to tackle this question like um, fractions question, strictly speaking, then what I would do, I would convert two and a half hours into an improper fraction. So I'd multiply the whole number by the denominator. Two multiplied by five is 10, and then add that 10 to the numerator to get 11 over five, 
right? And I'll have to multiply now by 60, which is the number of minutes in one hour. Okay, and then I'll say 5 into 5, 1 by cross-canceling. Remember, we can either cancel vertically or diagonally, right? Never horizontally. So 5 into 5, 1, 5 into 60 is 12. And 11 multiplied by 12 is going to give me the same answer of 132 minutes. Okay, so that's it for today, guys. Thank you for tuning in and do join us again tomorrow, God willing, for another episode in the SEA Specimen Paper Series. Take care. Goodbye.